Hello, hello. I am I am here with uh random people I don't even know. I will shit on your desk. <laughs> one, one sec, I'm gonna go get some I'm gonna go get something to drink, so I'm gonna like um one sec. Gotcha. I'm in first place. No. This this almost never happens. I'm no longer in first place. I have the ability to climb. Beware my power. Fucking beat beat my meat, bitch. Whoa. There's a character called There's there's a character whose name is Beat in this game. <laughs> yeah, but it sounds like... So so I decided to so so my common insult when I'm getting angry at that character is to say beat my meat, bitch. Oh. You sexualize a child character. Not child care. Oh fuck! No, wait a minute. <laughs> Cartoon character. Why did I say? <laughs> I I don't know the IP that he's originally from, so he might be underage. But I honestly don't give a shit. Fuck him. <laughs> why did I say child care? <laughs> Listen, the internet is a thing. Yep, and so is Rule 34. If it exists on the internet, it will be sexualized. Wait, what's Rule 35? Fuck if I know. I think there's also, like, Rule 64, which is, like, uh, if it exists, there's a gender bend of it. So there's a gender bend version of me on the internet. I mean, I guess. Don't know how that would work with your character, but... There's a been version of Jack Bright, so... I mean, yeah. Ar I mean, arguably, the inspiration for your character is that. Yeah. I... Oh, fucking ages, you will not beat me. No. No, with that, uh, you... Right. Checking Damn it! Now, Hatchet, there's one good thing about this, uh, about the Chapter 3 hatch, is that yeah. you've already proof-checked <laughs> the, um, the test, uh, test shit. I forgot. The 914 test. Hey, the, the, the test logs, yeah. Yeah, you've already, did it, so you don't have to re- <laughs> you, don't, you don't have to worry about it. I mean, when I go through it, I probably will go through that again, just to doubly sure but that's yeah. assuming my brain lets me because I've been having a lot of issues on it. that's fair I fucking lost that race by one position I hate my life I always hate my life well don't that's my job that you hating my life Yes. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> so mean. My job is hating you. <laughs> Hansel has a huge beard, uh, long unruly hair, and defeated eyes. Rocky was fuck? young, clean shaven, handsome, of such spirit. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> what is that person on about? I don't know. Why is everyone you work for a fucking loom? Because this is the SCP universe. I don't think it is. <laughs> it is now, bitch. 
That's not how that works. <laughs> God damn it, I need to stop crashing my yeah. Now, there's one thing. If I do get into VTuber group, they're probably going to want me to do a lot of collab streams with the other, you know, people in the group. Yeah. So I might not be as apparent in here. <laughs> yeah. Did I use that word right? Uh... Probably not. Maybe more. Maybe the word you're looking for is present. Yeah. Why did I say apparent? apparent. <laughs> I may not appear in this place much. I may not be apparent in this, in this place much. <laughs> I may be translucent. I may or may not be transgender. <laughs> Look, we'll I see may or may not be. Huh? May or may not be transparent. <laughs> I may or may not be transistor. Hmm. I may or may not be transcendent. I may or may not be trash. <laughs> but yeah, ba basically, like I had um, on Twitter, I saw that Hemet Meta uh, posted a thing talking about the fact that fucking uh, Mr evolutionary biologist uh Richard Dawkins decided to come out and say that there is in fact only two sexes despite the vast majority of biological consensus on the matter uh. that man is such a shit show Oh, yeah, no. yeah, there's actually one thing I've always uh, wondered when what right. would stop being uh, a debate. Oh, right. Speaking of scientists, there's one thing I'm wondering when it will stop being a debate. Like, there are still scientists debating whether or not a virus will be able to be classified in an animal class. Or, like, as a living thing. Yeah. Yeah, that's... It's it's a whole ass conversation. And it also hurts my brain. It's kind of hard to prove it to be an animal because it doesn't exactly. Well, do... it wouldn't. Oh. Oh, that's what it, it, it wouldn't. Hmm? Yeah, it's it, it it wouldn't be in. It, it wouldn't be considered an animal. It would be considered its own. Uh, thing. Yeah, its own. What is it? Kingdom? Yeah. Or maybe, uh, uh either kingdom or, or familia uh, or something like that. Not familia. It's further back. Not further back. Okay. Also, bookworms in chat now. Good to know. Hey bookworm, how shocked are you to hear that I'm that that my head is hurting as a result of fucking Richard Dawkins? Oh, bookworm says kingdom or subset of bacteria, maybe. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah. So it e it would either be its own kingdom or it would be added to the kingdom bacteria. Or whatever the technical term is. Yeah, no. I think it would still be hard for them to even be able to do that. Cause... I mean, yeah. Taxonomy is fucky. Yeah. 
I thought it was a really good uh, thing I saw that I shared on Twitter. Is uh like a couple of biologists, or uh, well, a biologist as well as I, I think someone who was more into talking about gender theory, uh, made a statement that was to the tune of uh, gender is a lot like taxonomy in the sense that it is like from the outside it can look really strictly and well defined but once you get into the nitty gritty of it it is an absolute shit show of all over the place bullshit and like a, a biologist that works with taxonomy chimed in and said that they love this analogy because a good example is uh what is a fish scientifically because that's something that's actually almost impossible to properly define through taxonomy like it either has to be given an extremely unique classification where we say it's only like anything that's within these like this specific range of tech of uh classes or orders i can't remember which but this specific range of groupings everything within this range are fish and anything that came from that range that doesn't fit relatively within what we socially perceive to be a fish that's not a fish even though like when you get to the the full fish of certain uh you, you come to the conclusion that all tetrapods are in fact fish and thus humans are fish because we evolved from fish so like it's it's incredibly hard to define what the fuck a fish is even though when i'm saying a fish everyone here knows what i am talking about but like yeah. in terms of like strictly actually getting to the nitty-gritty and deciding this is what scientifically classifies as a fish is such an absolute shit show Why are you randomly jolting up for some reason? Because you're a bitch. But yeah, I think I specifically uh, ended up laughing my ass off at the fact that like the person who works with taxonomy at one point made the statement Despite the sheer, b despite the fiction that is fish, which is like a really funny statement to think about, the fiction that is fish, fish are fictional. Danica Patrick. Yeah, this game is really odd because, like, you have all of these, like, Sega property characters and, like, a couple non Sega property characters. Just all, like, cartoon video game characters. And then you have a real ass racer named Danica Patrick in it. What's wrong with Danica Patrick? There's nothing wrong with her, it's just jarring. Maybe Danny Patrick just really likes Sonic. I highly I highly doubt that. I think it was just a brand deal. I would find it really funny if Danny Patrick was actually a huge Sonic fan. It would act that that would actually be really funny. <laughs> like it's not outside of the realm of possibility, but it's less likely. Than just there being a brand deal. Because I know that that is like what got her in. Okay. I'm in front. I'm in first place. I can win this. Uh, Chu is lurking in chat and trying to play in small mouse violence. 
uh, bookworm, use your powers to stop them. This bitch. <laughs> wow. The game just fucking cheated me. I hate this game, but I love this game. Oh, I would always piss people off in Mario Kart. Like, who would all like say I would always have the Mario Kart God on my side? Because literally every time, last round, it's the first question block I get. I always get the blue shell, no matter what. Uh. Every fucking time I get the blue shell, and I just wait till I like in second place. I just wait till it's near the finish line. And I just throw it. Damn. <laughs> and then they usually end up getting last place. And I just hear them getting so fucking mad. So in other words, if we ever play Mario Kart, play a game, play one of the games that doesn't have blue shells in it. Yeah. <laughs> and also, I I usually fuck up the first lap so I can see shortcuts. I mean that's not that that's that's relatively smart if you aren't used to the map. Yeah, that's what I did when I first played. I just kept fucking up so I can see shortcuts and go like, "Yep, uh, see you, bitch." And I'm I just took first. <laughs> I fail so that I may win. Yeah, there was actually a tournament in my uh, driver's ed class at the end of the year. Mario Kart, uh, I always kept getting first or second place. <laughs> <laughs> Mainly because they kept using maps of blue shoes. <laughs> so every time they, they... I kid you not, the teacher turned it off thinking that there was a cheat code on it. Turned it back on and had me play. And I immediately got a blue shell first round. <laughs> The game is like, fuck you for turning me off. Extra blue shell. I see you're you're in VC now, Chew. Hello, Chew. But here's, but here's the thing, Chew. Oh no, I noticed. I just didn't say anything, Chew. Uh, uh, I'm too I'm too busy racing. Yeah, I know it was the second you joined, but anyway, Chu, uh, you know, do you realize by being in this chat, you can't do small mouse violence. Because we can see the small mouse violence. What the fuck is your logic there? <laughs> I'm really confused, like, what... <laughs> Don't worry about it. Who's tearing up what? Fuzzy fuckers. Did you know that Garfield has a racing game? Yes. That's all that needs to be said. And that's just a Mario Kart ripoff. <laughs> Hey, Bright, guess guess which character is at the front of the race right now. Not you. Well, not me, yeah, but... <laughs> that's not the answer I'm looking for. Uh, Margaret um, Thatcher. What? No, Margaret... I'm not playing Mario Kart, I'm playing Supersonic... Uh, Racing Transform. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, Samus. <sighs> Alright, just for that, I ain't gonna talk about this anymore. <laughs> we, we have officially broken Hatchet. You haven't broke me. I'm just tired of it. Tired of all of it. Was it like Rose? Uh, Rouge or something? No. 
Rouge is not in this game. It was Danica Patrick, the actual racer that's in the game. For now. What do you mean for now? This game is like a decade old. You'll never know when they get taken out of the game. It ain't being updated, Brian. That you know of. No, it ain't being updated. It's for the 360. So? I'm just hurting to hatch it at the moment by just speaking. There is a cat. Hey! Uh, fucking cats. <laughs> Wait, you can break hatch shit at least once a stream. Wright is going to use her glitching powers to enter the game. You can play as Dr. Aaron Wright this book. I mean, that's actually not too far off because this game does feature the ability to play as, like, your Xbox character for the 360. So, like, if you manage to make your... Xbox avatar look like Aaron Bright, it wouldn't be uh it, it wouldn't be that much of an issue. Yeah. Wait a minute, I just realized my the avatar would literally be the uh the the, the glitching child from Wreck It Ralph. I forgot her name. Oh, I forgot her name too. Hmm. I mean Re Re Ralph from Wreck It Ralph is in this game. Ooh. Wait, what? <laughs> Seriously? Yes, he actually is in this game. Don't... Okay, do question it. It's really weird. <laughs> it, it, this game came out around when the first Wreck-It Ralph came out, and for some reason they got him in the game. Disney's okay with that? Well, I, they licensed it, obviously. Yeah, in fact, I think the only two, or no, the only three non-Sega characters in the game are uh, Danica Patrick, Ralph, and uh, the player character thing, where you can play as your avatar. Uh, uh, Penelope Von Sweets. I had to double check. I got her first name right. Hmm. I need to rewatch that movie. I never even watched the second one. The second one was okay, but I like the first one better. I had, I I remember adoring the first one. Plus, it may or may not have awakened something in me. Paul oh. Mirat military lady. Oh. Yeah, come to think of it, come to think of it, I think the child, if they were in here, would also say something to the tunes of that. And again, I have never had a crush on uh, a cartoon character. Okay. In here. And with water. Okay, so she was back with water. Restart. Your ace. Oh. It makes sense. It doesn't uh, mean I can't have like romantic crushes, but. <laughs> oh, Chu, you're away. Um, what is your opinion on the tall military lady from uh, Wreck It Ralph? Um, I think that she would. Surprisingly, one of the funnier parts of the movie. Unironically. Well, I can agree with that, but I was thinking more along the lines of the fact that I'm pretty sure she awakened something in me. I mean, not really for me, because I was... I was too... Sorry, but my gamer brain was in charge, and I was too oh, busy... Oh, you know what, that's fair. 
I was too busy clapping like a seal at all the video games. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's fair. It is... Wreck-It Ralph was so well made, and then they ruined it by making a sequel. Yeah, that's why I said the sequel's okay. Wrong! The sequel was bad. I never got to watch the sequel. I, I, I Don't, enjoyed you're some not parts missing of anything. It. Just yeah. because you said that, I'm going to make sure to watch it at some point. I wouldn't. I, shoot, I liked some parts of it. It wasn't all bad. Well, of course it's not going to be all bad, but overall it's terrible. And, like, quite frankly, unnecessary. Unnecessary, I agree with. Based, Look. like, completely without having seen it. It's entirely unnecessary. Look, yeah, shoot, they're, it's Disney. They're, they're, they're going to make... They're going to make sequels. They I know, need but I don't money. have to like it. Yeah, it's just... I am of the opinion that there is absolutely nothing wrong with a one-hit wonder. But they're Disney. They need more money. No, no, Bookworm. It didn't just retread stuff from the first movie. It massacred some of the things we learned in the first movie. Like, Ralph was acting like an insecure man-child. And it was kind of creepy at times, not gonna lie. They were really channeling the Gamergate era then, huh? No, it wasn't... There wasn't any misogyny, it was just that uh. he was... Really, really clingy, and for no reason. Uh, and he made lots of stupid decisions for no reason. He literally almost got lots of people killed, including his friend, because of his clinginess. Hmm. And then to add insult to injury, they directly stated the message of the movie in the movie. Uh... Kids are not that stupid. They're stupid, but not that stupid. It, it, it was just insulting. Oh, right, to add on to the Mario Kart thing from earlier, um, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe got an update somewhat recently, so now you can have custom items. Oh. Meaning that sounds like an awful idea. It is a beautiful idea, because now you can have races that are literally just blue shells. <laughs> okay, that actually does sound really funny. <laughs> but at the same time, you see, I, I, I've, I've, I've watched enough of Click's D&D videos to know that you should never give your players that much creative freedom. It is a beautiful, beautiful thing, though. Have you ever seen all blue shells on Adam... The track Baby Park. I you mean, know? I haven't, I haven't seen anything from the game, so no. So pretty much, Baby Park is the easiest track in Mario Kart. There are no hazards. It's very small, very short, and the main appeal: items spawn like crazy. Oh dear God! In fact, it's hard. When you're playing on Baby Park, it's hard to not get items. And like I said, it's a very short course. You can double, sometimes even like triple lap people. Especially if they have no clue what they're doing. Even though it's literally just a rectangle. And then... <laughs> With 
So, you have that picture in mind. Now picture that with everyone constantly getting two blue shells at once. And somehow, unlike with Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, whenever I watch that, I have not seen a single bit of lag from people playing online. Weird how that works. Uh, it's a beautiful He's, sight. Is Chu still disappointed in me for buying the DLC? For what? For Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Yes. Hey, hey, it's a good streaming thing. It's also a good contributing to the problem thing. They, 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 that was just disgraceful. I the fact that they, oh. the fact that they put that out knowing that it was in the state that it's in. And it's still in that state. They did not fix much. And they're not gonna. And they're still gonna charge $60 and 35 for the DLC. Fucking Danica Patrick. I don't think it's Danica Patrick's fault. My issues are. You know what, fair enough. Because Danica Patrick just passed me in the race. Throw a blue shell at her. I do not have blue shells. Then this is a get one. There's no items in this race. There's a bring boost... your own. This is a boost race. The only thing that exists on the map basically are boosters. Throw a booster at her. That is not a thing that can be done. Did you try? <laughs> it's, it hurts my brain trying to think about how you could do that. There are features on the map. Well, you just, you know, you gotta, gotta keep your shoulders loose, crack your knuckles, get down on your knees, crouch, and remember to lift with your legs. Don't lift with your back, lift with your legs. Hey, Hatch. I'll lift with my balls. Hey, Hatcher, I know how I can help you. Uh, you get a chow and just toss them relentlessly at your enemies in that game. What? You have to throw the babies at them. Neither of you are helpful. I am very helpful. No, you really aren't. I am innocent and small. Bullshit. And I unironically really want that necklace that Adorno pinged me for. I, I want it. Like, I, I need it. <laughs> I, I need it. Look for him, not the chow. I don't need it. I don't need it. I definitely don't need it. I love that first episode of Spongebob. Was that the first episode? Yeah. Oh, damn. Because oh, remember, yeah. it's, it's when he met Sandy. Right, yeah, so like... Yeah, so it was like the first section was the Krusty Krab thing, and then the second one was... That little silent. Sandy. No, the second section was that little short silent thing where he was trying to get rid of that one little shell with the reef blower and ended oh, up sucking yeah. all the water in the ocean. <laughs> wait. Oh, wait. Uh, was, was the one where he, like, gets hired at the Krusty Krab, the pilot? Um. Well, I guess technically the whole thing was the pilot episode, but uh. the um, but fundamentally, it, yeah, it was the first section of the pilot episode. Right. Okay. Yeah. I'm getting 
I'm getting screwed over because like it's been so long and it took me a second to remember that Spongebob has like those 15 minute stories rather than 30 minutes. Plus, I don't, plus it's also the fact that Spongebob is older than me. Like that first episode aired in May of 1999. Yeah. And that's just wild to me. Like, it's not even a 2000s cartoon. It's technically a 90s cartoon. Wait, I have a question. If it was technically supposed to be on Adult Swim, right? In Adult Swim, I don't know. Now. Yeah, I remember. It, I it know. was supposed to be on Adult Swim. So that makes me wonder, what, why was it supposed to go on Adult Swim in the first place? What was it supposed to eventually, characters supposed to eventually do? actually do that to be on the adult is, channel this is something i've never heard and i'm inclined not to believe you considering that you regularly say stuff that isn't true or just don't know things well i'm looking it up right now bitch you're not allowed to call me that generally speaking right when you say something you want to look it up before you say it the rule of thumb. I remember you're, you're it. it okay. Yes. SpongeBob was actually made for adults and originally aired on Adult Swim, but when the producers realized they had a wide youth audience, Nickelodeon got it. Fuck you, it was supposed to go on Adult Swim. I didn't say you were incorrect, I said I don't trust you. <laughs> there is a distinction. I know I know my adult swim logic. <laughs> <laughs> that statement that's alone. A dunk, you know it is. I don't. Yeah, that that's a dunk. That statement alone gives me every reason to doubt you. Yeah, but that still makes me wonder. Like, why was it on Adult Swim in the first place? I don't Let's know. See. Ask the first about... episode. The, the first episode of Spongebob was originally going oh, to feature... Oh, you can't ask him because he's dead. The, the first know. episode of Spongebob was originally going to feature a particular squid, uh, on the line. Are you referencing Squidward's... I, oh, wait. Yes, yes, that is what I was doing. <laughs> okay. Well, wait, hang on, I'm <laughs> sorry, but I have to do this. Well, well actually... Squidward is an octopus, not a squid. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh yeah, did I ever say that that the Squidward S word actually got an appearance on the actual show? Yes, and I saw the episode. It was surreal to actually see that get officially acknowledged. Yeah, it, was it, a... it was fucking wild. Yeah, I was power of the internet. I actually didn't see the episode. I saw it, but it was a while ago. And the best part is, is that there is a precedent for octopi to unalive themselves in real life. That just got the person. I want to try and help. Octopi evolve so I can see just how intelligent they become. You just want them to become octolings, we get it. I know. I am I am genuinely interested in how an animal like an octopus got as intelligent as it is. That is bizarre to me. That's fair. If I'm like, if I'm not mistaken, it's largely because of, um, the style of hunting they've developed. Like, generally speaking, uh, for an animal to be able to engage into the level of uh, camouflage that they do, you're going to need to have a pretty fucking big brain and be able to be extremely adaptive. Actually, if I'm not mistaken, one of the more, in, like, the the oddest thing about it is that, like, most uh, 
most extremely intelligent animals tend to be highly social animals. Like, intelligence tends to spring from social structures. But, if I'm not mistaken, octopi are not particularly social animal animals, which does make it really interesting. Yay, Dixie's on one. Oh, wait, I got distracted. Um, <laughs> you be quiet. Hush. Um, Bookworm says, how did silly a people get as intelligent as we are? I don't know. And I honestly think it was a mistake, because look at us now. I mean, like I said, complex social structures. We saw fire. We make fire. Ooh, banana. The, uh... That's the thing that always weirds me out a bit, though. Like, when people, like, say that, like, when humans are gone, it's going to be octopi and cephalopods that take over the world. I no, that would be bugs. I like if if we're talking like animals based upon their sheer intelligence, it's birds, corvids and parrots. Could like genuinely have a chance of evolving the necessary structures to become a second sapient species. I personally do think that squids and octopi deserve it better, and Splatoon only further confirm that bias for me. E. I finally won the damn race. One could say that it is confirmation bias, if you will. Uh, hey Hatchet, someone just painted their own crime on their house. How do you- that- that's just graffiti, bitch. Right. Bray, please uh, clean off the graffiti before you uh, clean, clean, clean off the graffiti. <laughs> because you're starting to scare me now. What do you mean? The way that you thought someone graffitied the crime they committed <laughs> inside of their house is concerning to me. I mean, you don't know. Someone could do that. You know, on one hand, like, that does feel particularly stupid, but on the other hand... This isn't Florida. Well, that's the thing. I've I've watched enough true crime stuff to know that there are absolutely people that are that fucking stupid. And commonly, the only difference between uh, a, 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 an absolute idiot and a mastermind serial killer supposed mastermind serial killer the only difference between those two things are commonly just a slightly competent and not lazy police force like seriously when, when you look through the history of like serial killers especially here in America but it's kind of an issue all over the place there's just this constant question of what the fuck are the cops doing and what are people doing? Like, there, there's just insane instances of, like, like, uh, serial killers, like, not being caught as soon as they could have been because someone just, like, actually sees a crime taking place that's, like, incredibly horrific and just doesn't report it. Which is, like, when it's, when it's, like, when it's inconsequential things... I mean, yo, 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 ho, ho, we don't advocate for that, but, like, when it's like, you just saw a child get killed, I don't know, maybe, maybe you should call the police. Just a thought. Uh. I, I will just say this, I am just going to sincerely hope that there's someone... If anything like that right. it's near me, hopefully what? it doesn't. But I... <laughs> Why did you feel the need to take off his head and just leave him back? <laughs> because did you just take off, off his head and he's just left with a bag? Off with his head. Uh, but uh, was, can, His name was King Louis. Louis. Uh, wow. Right. I'll give you. I'll give you a fictional cookie if you can say which uh, Roman numeral would be coming after his name. King Louis the. 
Was it the 17? I thought it was the 6th. Wait, Hatchet, you didn't know either? Wait, I thought it was... Am I that dumb? Was it the 16th? Wait, answer. Damn it. It was the 16th. God damn it. God damn it. So bright was... Anyway, the 14th was... Because there was, a king, I remembered that there was a King Louis the Fourteenth, and that wasn't the person who died. It was, yeah, over time. Oh wait, that's what I think I know. What put me off? I saw like that meme of like a Stolfo doing ballerina stuff or ballet, as like men should dress like men, as like giving a whole bunch of examples of how what we can said to be feminine clothing were actually masculine clothing in the past and on that it mentioned Louis the sixth and I think that fucked over my brain mm. in conclusion I just pulled a bright oh, oh, fuck the you. Best of this yeah, hey I'm it's just happy that best. I actually was closer And you were literally just blown off. Is there even a King Louis the Seventeenth? No, because well, consider <laughs> considering the Sixteenth was the one that got his head chopped off. I don't think there was. <laughs> like, the French were like, okay, so this didn't work out. The first, at least. 16 right, times. Right, right. Give this one more go. Right. Yeah. I saw what you were doing. What? Oh, so you weren't meaning to make a phallic shape? No. <laughs> oh, you were. That shit. It looked like you were very purposefully making a phallic shape. No. Is it weird that I hatch it in my you head? Don't. Is it weird that I thought that Bright wouldn't know what that word means? <laughs> I know what phallic means. Fuck you. <laughs> Brax, though. Nice try, but I know that you wouldn't. So, empty threat. That you know of. Huh? I'm so confused. What just happened? Deal with it, bitch. You're not allowed to call me that. You're not one of the people on the <laughs> on the guest list who's allowed to say that to me. We will call anyone we wish That's to me. call, bitch. Danny, you're not on the guest list either. Uh, Adara, mm -hmm. can you uh, uh, ping the person that can into this setting and join this voice chat? No. Oh. As sure as that work. And also, and, or, I have, and also, Momo, I don't think is. Well, well, Momo might. No, stop doing this. Being the Momo. Uh, give me a moment. I need to go send someone something. Oh, I, I... wait. Boker says, uh, yeah, there was. Oh, so he technically was alive and had the title, but he died at 14. Oh, L. okay. So L. yeah, there was a King Louis the 17th. L. He, he caught an L. Skill issue. Yeah. Well, now we know something interesting. There was a King Louis the 17th. Oh, this is just an interesting thing for me to just switch back to another server and just randomly see here um i did it's not... horny isn't it yes and i don't <laughs> what life decisions did i make to lead me to here to all of you just these being places? horny it's not a horny server it's literally just the horn this meme is giving me a tumor. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. 
I hate it. It you makes hate me... it that much, that means you actually love it. It makes me hey, ill. Is it in the server that I'm in, too? Yeah, it's in um, Cerus's server. But this meme in a different server. Hang on. Let's see. Hey, sure. Momo, when you get this, could you simply send the single word bitch to Chew when you get the chance? Thanks. Did you just... Did you actually ping, or did you just DM them? I DM'd them. <laughs> <laughs> the Chew goes silent. Alright, look in the x-ray bit so you can see this meme that makes me irrationally angry. <laughs> that, is, that is a war crime. Very the good. way those cords are is, so, is a war crime. I bet you. I, bet I you see would, something. Nothing wrong would, with I that. I bet you would be in the second picture, huh? Wait, huh? I bet you would like to be in the second picture, huh? I'm not gonna ignore. I'm not gonna dignify that with a response. Oh shit! Apparently, which King is all the response we need. Welcome has some more information about King Louis the Seventeenth. Apparently, he Arr. died a month before the French Revolution. Oh really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, oh god! So that that kid came into the world just to be given the title, and then got yeeted out before shit hit the fan. Yeah. Honestly, that's probably that's probably for the best. And was he actually a king or was he like a prince? No, I said kid. Was he... No, no, I mean, was he actually a king or the prince? No, he would have been. Because he prince. could have been Prince Louis the Seventeenth. Yeah, he was prince, but he was given Louis the Seventeenth, so. Yeah. Had had he come of age and had uh, France not imploded, there could have been a King Louis the Seventeenth. Bookworm said there wasn't a King uh, Louis the Seventeenth. Okay. Book, Bookworm said, "Oh, he wasn't king. I messed that up. Sorry. Yeah, Prince. Yeah. Dang it, Bookworm! You're not supposed to spread leftist misinfo in here. Spread more leftist misinfo. It's not even misinfo." <laughs> It was just a simple mistake. How is it oh leftist God, misinfo? Jerry, oh, no. no. What did Jerry say? Jerry, no. <laughs> Let me check. <laughs> oh my God. I love Jerry. <laughs> anyway, uh, it's oh, about uh, it's pro it's probably about time for me to go see if my mom needs the rub, so I will be back. Courts, they're so upsetting to me. Deal with it, motherfucker. No. No, I don't think I will. Don't suffer. I'm such a good friend of you, she, aren't I? No. Also, I want that collar. Like, I I hate that Adurna now made that live in my head rent free. I want that collar. With it, you're welcome. not ever going to get that collar. Yes, I am. There are plenty of people who would want to put a collar on me. I'm not going to. I'm going <laughs> to say that. I am going to stop talking. Mm -hmm. Keep continuing, Jim. Come on. No. And Bookworm, stop bonking me. <laughs> Keep the bonking. I believe in you, Book. Yeah, I can see bonking the shoe. Why don't you take a quote? It'll last longer. But I'm not going to remind you what I said, so I hope your memory is good.
It's so hard to see a flashing orange on orange. Scale issue. Right. If you maybe you should use a different, like a different hose thing then to help you get it. No, the the other hose isn't strong enough to get this nice bit of dirt. Just reason. spray in literally every direction. Wait, what? <laughs> How did that actually work? <laughs> That's why you should always listen to me. Okay, so it's not in this area. Right? Yes. Right? I'm, you're gonna leave down now. It worked before. There we go. What's wrong with so Now I gotta find. Also, Bookworm, stop making Adurna's job easier. Stop quoting me. <laughs> God damn, I keep hitting E. <clears throat> Sleepy. No. Taking down one at a time. Use the power of my big brain to handle it cleaning all this shit. Almost fucking done with this fucking house. And everyone decided to go dead quiet for some reason. Well, that's not very nice to the house. I don't give a fuck. Haven't you ever seen Monster House? If you're mean, the house will eat you. That's and something you, you would enjoy, too. It's cursed. Actually, no. The, um, the monster... That movie, I. No, I was talking about that, that, movie that house. Is bad in a special way. Oh yay! Asher's DMing me. Ooh. Be quiet, both of you. Shut up. <laughs> I turned didn't even say anything. Exactly. It's a <laughs> it's a preemptive shut up.
Got it. What else do I need? Positionally back by the by your uh, by your ladder. I guess I can the ladder. I mean it. Oh, there we are. This house does not want you to leave. No joke, because I can't find a last... Wait, there's this right here. Uh... Oh, 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 um... What? Y'all, I'm flustered. Deal with it, motherfucker. Ash, Ash is, uh... So, Ash, I, I think it is, um... What is it called? I am... Um, I might have told Ash about the collar. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and how uh, you enjoy the kinky fun time. Be quiet. Or was I wrong? Oh, um... Um, Asher is asking if they can join the PC. Uh, sure, I don't care. Join? More than air, it's a bully to the shoe. No. Am I right? Not now. Now I got this thing. Oh, right. I think. Looks like you already got it. Oh, yeah, I did get it. Timber pillar. I think it was this right. Wait, that's trying to do. Timber frame. Okay, so this is the frame. It's right here. Where would be one of those? Oh, it's too Hi, Asher. Hey, Asher. Hi, random person I don't know. Right, be nice. Or else I will kick you from your own voice chat. Look, I didn't promise I would be nice. Yeah. You've been muted. I'm petty. But no, we're just messing around.
How are you, Asher? I'm okay. How's everyone else? I just... I'm good. True is needed, so. <laughs> oh, no. I see that. <laughs> Revenge, motherfucker. <laughs> You know that he can do the same to you too, right? Yeah, but he's not. But they're not. They, they, they can remove it right now. They wanted to. They, they just have yet to remove it. He may not have realized. You petty bitch. <laughs> they they went <wouldn't> twitch. <laughs> They've realized. Unmute me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're unmuted. I hate you. <laughs> you're my mod doll, so you have to get used to it. <laughs> that sounds really messed up and mean. Every... I'm I'm just gonna be quiet. Do you see Asher? Do you see how they bully me? They are mean. They're mean to me. Mm-hmm. And Asher approves, right? <laughs> I didn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> but you also didn't say no. <laughs> True, you are very bullyable. No. I adore you, and you are bullyable. No. No, no one's on my side. I am not supposed to be bullied. You like it when no one's on your side, right? I'm not responding to that. I'm invoking my Fifth Amendment right to not self-incriminate. So that's yes. Okay. No, it's not. It is a... It's not to, to not self-incriminate, so yes, that's a yes. Well, I could just be saying that I would be incriminating myself. Mm -hmm. I could be lying. Which means it's a yes. No, it's not. Right. Now I just need to find a way to retaliate against the Derna for sending me the picture of that fucking collar. Because it is stuck in my head and I... It gives me conflicting emotions and I hate it. You're welcome. Hmm. There's two temper frames. Oh, I thought I heard an ad for Power Rangers on TV. Bookworm, don't bonk me. That's not nice. Bonk them even more. <laughs> I am friend shaped, allegedly, and I should not be bonked. Uh, yeah, allegedly. Yes, allegedly, because I am not friend shaped. Saying that I am friend shaped is leftist misinfo. Friend shaped Bry, I'm being bonked again. I don't care. Do something. Do something. Intervene. I'm not sure what Bry would do would just bonk would just bonk you yourself. No so bookworm, mad. that is not No bookworm, that is not what it means. Being friend-shaped, which I am not, does not mean I should get more bonks. 
physics. <laughs> there is no math involved there. What is there? No. Shoo, shoo, would you, would you prefer stubbies? I'm not gonna respond to that either. Bless you. Okay. No, it's not. Yes, yes, yes. No, it's not. You have it is. citation needed. Let me see. Uh, Serena. That's not a citation. That is a word. Where is it? No, it's a name. First of all, it's, it's, it's a Pokemon. Are words. It's a Pokemon. Serena is a Pokemon. I'm afraid I don't know what you're talking about. Serena is a Pokemon that you have once stated that you would you want them to step on you. I don't know what you're talking about. This never happened. There are no other witnesses. And you also want to be crushed by them, so... Sorry, I don't know what you're talking about. There were no witnesses, which means that it's your word against mine. No, I was not win. There it goes. Yeah, I'm starting to get really tired all of a sudden for some reason. Uh, um... I was gonna say something, but I forgot what it was. Um... Bitch. No, Green you're not allowed to call me that. <laughs> I say whatever I want. It's my stream, motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, uh, Bright, are you gonna call it... If you're suddenly getting tired, are you gonna call it early? Probably. Bookworm says, then go sleep. I'm not gonna let the guy always sleep. It, that just shows that you should. No, right, go to bed. No, I stay up longer. Right, sleep, or else I'll um wave my fist in the air and fi and fuss at you. You know, there's actually one thing I wonder why the YouTubers do this. Is it called sleep streams, where you just watch their their models sleep? Um, so it's pretty much okay. Those are when they are doing um like their uh what is it called? They're doing like subathons. You subathon. know, uh, yeah, subathons. They mostly do that when. There's several phones. Actually, we pretty much only do that when there's several phones. That's several phones, says Brooke. But you sleepy. I'm not sleepy. Talking about me, but Pika. It still applies to me. No, it doesn't. Yeah. All right. Don't want to do this assignment. I don't want to deal with it, motherfucker. Let's see. How overdue is it? Let's see. It's due on. It's only two weeks overdue. Asher, do I have to finish this? Yes, you have to. Well, I don't wanna. I just wanna sit here. I like that. When you finish, you get a hug from Asher. Wait, oh, yeah, I couldn't. You were both talking at the same time. What was that, Bright? I said if you finish it, you get a hug from Asher. All right, I'll finish it. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even me saying that. It's the right saying that. Yeah. Hey, wait, that's right. 
<laughs> Ash, Asher didn't play it, so that means no, I don't have to listen to no, you. No, but you have to do it. Okay. <laughs> also, Wilkram is giving me head pats. There's one more temper frame. Alright. I don't even know what I'm supposed to criticize here. They pretty much hit the nail on the head for everything. There is literally nothing I can critique. They got everything correct. That's honestly harder than someone who fucked up their entire answer, because when someone, like, really understands something, you can't even criticize... You can't even uh, criticize them, because they've already... Like, they got it. Like, th this is a, um... This is one of those moments where you're just like, no notes. So fucking annoyed. Oh, um, Asher, I have good news. Um, I now officially know when I am, uh, graduating. Nice. Am, when is am, that? I am graduating from community college in, um, late May. Nice. I think the date was the, um, the 20-something. I, I can't remember the exact number. Hmm? Well, on my brain, my brain just went to 23rd. God, how am I supposed to criticize this? There's literally nothing that I can say that they didn't already say. Oh, uh, would it be the 20... It would probably be the 26th. Maybe. Maybe the 26th or 27th. Probably. It's... It's a number that starts with a 2. Hmm. And, you know, perhaps that's enough. I, I might have to call my school tomorrow because they were supposed to mail me about um how to get my cap and gown and stuff and it is no longer mid-march it is now late march where is my information on how to get my cap and gown uh -huh. Plus, I'm, I'm kind of going to need my tickets. I'm, I'm going to need my tickets. Well, I'm probably, I'm going to have to leave. Okay. I want to find this last spot so I can go to bed. Where is it? Are you sure it's a spot on the house? It says timber frame. There's only one timber friend, it's on the house. Did you check on the... Can you check the timber frame? The timber frame's on the roof? I don't think there is any on the roof, but I can double check. Also, Bokram, I can't nitpick it, like... Like, if so... Let's say that someone made, like, the perfect dish for you, and there's literally nothing they could have done... Be there's nothing that they could have done better. And you were asked to criticize it. That's kind of where I'm at right now. Someone gave a perfect response that I would expect to see... ...in, in my textbook. And I don't know where to go from here. Mm. 
you know what? Well, if I don't see any of you later tonight, good night. Okay. See you, Derna. Bye. 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 Love you all. Love you. Alright. How do I word this? Wait, am I overthinking it? Oh my god, I am overthinking it. I was... Oh my god. I was overthinking it. I could have had this done hours ago. <laughs> Don't ask. Why? <laughs> Also, no mean. You're not supposed to bully me. Everyone bully the chew? No. Okay. I'm gonna check the results, so... Why did I make the final one so fucking hard to find? Did you... You might just... You might just have to meticulously go, like, over every piece of wood carefully. Because, like, isn't it also sometimes split apart depending on where you're standing? Like, one wooden beam. <sighs> Sorry. One wooden beam that's identical to the other isn't. is split apart from the others. It could be something on the, um, on the, uh, roof that you're not seeing. I honestly don't know, because it looks like you perused every single bit of this house. Do you think it's that little angled part on the roof over there to your right? No, it's, it's actually called timber frame. It has to be called that in order to count. Not that. Or this one. Alright. Let me finish this up so this way this will be off my chest. I'm almost there.
there. Ah. Uh, all right, I'm all done. You did good. Oh, ridiculous. Uh oh, there's a pain. Oh, it's a, there's something else. Ah, it feels so good to get this way assignment off my chest. Got a full fucking circle. Not a single one of these needs it to be clean. Not. It may not be... That's actually really odd. There's no way it's a case where the game glitched, could it? Well, I can just... Oh, hey, Apollo. Hey, Apollo. Can't even leave. Oh, I forgot I can't hook up my games to my computer. I have to literally like... quit the game to leave. Fuck off, Curse Forge. Oh, hi, Apollo. That is so damn annoying. All I want to do is finish this. God, that gave me a heart attack. Oh, <laughs> why? <sighs> ah, hey, Ap hey, Apollo. Hey, Apollo. Finally, for fuck's sake! Oh, you got it! Yay! Oh my God! Fucking final. Yeah. Oops. Didn't mean to click on that. I am going to change the channel on the TV because I don't want to watch SpongeBob anymore. That's fair. Oh. Everything else that's on is garbage. That's yeah. not helpful. Alright, uh, fine. I'll watch it, Family Guy. I, I have no idea if that was Handsome Girl's House. Uh, it's on you. But anyway, book on last words, go. I'm too tired to continue. Yeah, right. You, you, you need to get some rest. No. Go to bed. Fuck you. No. That comeback didn't even make sense. No, it did not. Hey, I'm trying my best with what like, I have, okay? Like, 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 subscribe and follow right, 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 Also give her money, also give her money, money you can. can. God damn it, the fucking repeating shit. Anyway. Oh. Uh, I was gonna say it's still, it's still doing it. Yes. Uh. 
Anyway, Brooklyn says like, comment, subscribe, and follow Bright for more chill streams. Also, give her money if you can. True. Uh, Chew, last words, go. Um, support Bright. Um, buy her some more power washing equipment so that this will go easier. Um, and Bright, you are currently at my mercy, and I'm feeling generous, so I will not call you a bird. Wow. Also, Zonju says, the appropriate response to a fuck you is later. No. <laughs> that is my only comeback. No. <laughs> Anyway, uh, Asher, would you like to say any last words? Uh, like, comment, subscribe! Uh, Bright, you're awesome. Love you. Kiss, kiss. <laughs> you were probably the <laughs> kindest person to ever say any last words on the stream. <laughs> uh, you're welcome. Thank you. Uh, Apollo, would you like to say any last words? <laughs> Most wholesome last words. What's that? What uh, happened? Oh, uh, Bookworm said that Asher's the last words were wholesome. Like, the most wholesome. I mean, Asher is amazing and wholesome, so... Makes oh. sense. Did she... Oh. Oh. I was told to, uh, to go to bed, and they say but and Apollo says bye. <laughs> Are you about to say butt? <laughs> no, bye. What the fuck is wrong? Chew, that's stop being horny. Like. Stop that's being horny, it... Chew. Hey, hey, that is what it <laughs> sounded like at the very start of that. <laughs> You're the yeah, only no, one. No, make stop. me. Asher. No. What? Stop making. Uh, can you make Chew stop being horny? Chew. <laughs> no. It's okay, honest. you can be horny later. <laughs> okay, you know what? That's the best I can ask for. <laughs> Alright, now, Bright, you go to bed. Alright, my last words are, uh... Did you know and either the state or the or the state of Texas itself like like say it's around it in the past in order to do the hepatitis B vaccine they stabbed a long needle through both legs the more you know wow i see that just makes me hate needles even more <laughs> yeah that's happened that's an now actual I thing now i don't think i want to finish my vaccinations i'm joking <laughs> I'm joking. Finish your vaccinations, people. Or else I will bite your fingers. Maybe. Anyway, see you later, Danger Needles.